Hey, how's it going, everybody? My name is Kaz, and welcome back to Soda on the Nemo Deep Frag. It's still the same picture because I don't have my face cam, man. I got too lazy to change the picture. But anyways, today I'm on the login screen, so we're just gonna click here. And the reason I'm here, oh, okay, I thought he would come out, and I guess not. Okay, but today I believe we were supposed to get the Kuruha, but I guess she comes out later, not now. Oh yeah, it says 15. That's like... 3 p.m. UTC time? But, eh, I don't know, I don't, I'm don't. i bad with time zones. Anyways, today we got a couple new things. We have the new banner, Fatal Bullet, Unstoppable Force, and we also have the new ranking event. Also, I should mention about the weapons, but we also have the new ranking event, Steel Break Helpless, which I will go through Master Plus 2 with you guys, but I should also mention in these weapons, as you see, it's 4-star weapons guaranteed on Step 5. Now, that's actually pretty cool. So you can see on step 1 and 3, they're only 100 memory diamonds, and it's funny how step 1 is 2 star guaranteed, <laughs> but step 5 is a guarantee weapon, which is awesome. This is the first time they're doing a guarantee weapon on a step up for this. <laughs> I'm very happy about that, but if we do the calculations, that's about uh, 650 memory diamonds for a guarantee weapon, and once you get that, you get more stuff. Anyways, that is awesome to see and to be honest i might pull for the characters although i said i, I don't do record crystal scouts or anything i might just pull on them once on this account but let's look at the characters before i do that and uh, you saw the character i was going to use them in the ranking event anyways fatal bullet unstoppable force asana lifa silica and elizabeth now these characters heal they have party leader skill combination yes, skill so we got asana's gunners rosario here she does 11 hits and she has a hard hit at the end. What I like about the Asuna is that when she does the 10 hit combo, oh, I forgot to mention, but when she does the 10 hit combo, then she has a little pause and that gives us like a little attack up for when you have like over 10 hit combo so you can deal more damage with the Asuna. That's what I really like about her and about these characters too. But if you guys didn't know with these new weapons, the rifles, assault rifles, you can actually move around as you can see and they continuously hit the enemy. Which is honestly really nice, but I believe it also says something about reloading as you saw she had to stop for a bit and she was reloading and they also have parry like usual, but I should be looking at their SS ones and twos because you know they're new so Vor Vorpal Assault So yep, just like the other gunners and then we have quick draw Every other gun person anyways So Vorpal Assault with Leafa, Sonic Rampage Very nice and we have speed holic spree so that was 26 so about 12 hits and does she have hit at the end oh nice hit him one more time um yeah she she does it's like that hard hit at the end and also in the beginning so that's actually really cool anyways let's go let's, let's continue on so we got silica here sonic rampage spins in a circle plasma grenade i hate that <laughs> I hate that desperately when they use that against you, but now we can use it against them. So, Bullet Storm, this is the Lolly Police. Freeze, you touched my spaghetti. Bullet Storm. So, they all. It looks like she also has a 12 hit combo. Does she have a hard hit at the end? No, she doesn't. It doesn't look like she does. They're just continuous hits, and they're all like 10,000, 9,000, and they're all like critical hits. So, that was cool. But anyways, so quick draw with Liz, burst shot. Okay, and we have Grief Bullet. Near the end, she had a bunch of hard hits. As you saw, she had like two, three, 20 hit, 20 hits, 20k hits, and then the last one was 30k. So right now, I'm really leaning towards Lisbeth being the best character here. So they're gun characters. I don't really need to bother checking if they can use it here. So I'm not, I'm not really gonna- Ah, screw it. Might as well check, right? So let's see. Can we do it from anywhere? Will they hit the- Will they hit the enemy? Did he, did he miss? Maybe, well, he was on the floor. Let's try again. Okay, I think they're good. Speed Holic? Okay, Liz misses. Or, the Leafa misses. Kind of sad. <laughs> Poor Liz. Learn to aim. A uh, Bullet Storm. Okay, Silica chases after the enemy, and then she goes behind the enemy. Right now, I'm really liking the Silica-Elizabeth combination. Grief Bullet. 
And then the lizard just goes to the enemy. Okay, so in my opinion, I'm really liking Liz right now. Like, I think Liz might be the better one. In my opinion, despite her <laughs> supposed to not using guns, but you know. <laughs> but honestly, like, all of them are really good. They all have over 10 hit combos. Uh, it's not... It's not fast. It's okay. Some of them are lengthy. Like, Leafa's right there was pretty lengthy. Okay, so Leafa to Asuna was decently, like, speed-wise. Let's see, Silica to Liz. Uh, I think that was just a little bit slower than the Leafa Asuna. Let's try this one. Okay, the thing about that is that she misses. Might, no, that's on. Okay. I think the Lizbeth Silica duo is faster. But there's that chance. Well, then again, it's small. But if it's a boss, I think they'll do fine. Now, they only heal. But then again, you know, you can get any character that can buff them if you want strength buff or anything. So, I don't think these characters are that bad. I think they're good. And... I'm not gonna like continuously pull on them like I did with the Valentine's, the first Valentine's banner. I'm only gonna do step one. Well, first I did another scout on another account, which I'll show that later. But I think, I honestly, in my opinion, I think the Liz Lizbeth Silica combo and Lizbeth, the character herself, is the best out of all of them. And then uh, if I might add maybe Asuna. I don't know, maybe Silica second. I don't know. Well, no. She doesn't have the heart hit, it's just consecutive hits. So maybe like Austin a second. Because she has the heart hit. Then again, there's, there's Leafa 2 at the beginning, and she has two of them. So maybe uh, Elizabeth, Leafa, Asuna, and then Silica. But combination wise, I really like this Leaf or Elizabeth Silica duo. That's okay. There we go. That's my opinion. <laughs> So anyways, um, they will have scout up raids for like the duos for Asuna and Leafa, and then another week we'll have Elizabeth and Silica. I'm only gonna pull for those those scouts, but if I don't get anything, I don't get anything. Um, hopefully I'll have enough to do a record crystal, but <laughs> let's hope for the best we actually get something. Come on Argo buddy! Give me one of these characters in this account, please, so I don't have to do the other scouts, and I can just go through weapons. Argo, I love you! I'd be louder, but I can't. <laughs> Please. That hurts my feelings. It's green. Okay, at least it wasn't blue. Man, my scouts have not been lucky lately. Three. Yeah. So, I'm just going to keep pulling on the other step-up rates thing. And that's when I'll like use my diamonds. Although, I don't like doing this. This is the last time I'm going to do scout-up things for these. Although, I don't think they're, they're like the best. Because... I think eventually we'll have another banner for this, but it'll have like Kirito, and I believe in Fatal Bullet, Klein, and Agil were in it too, but we can't expect too much because, you know, we, we don't have that many Klein, Agil, like four or five stars, but I can see Kirito being one. Maybe another Kuduha in the future, Zeliska, I think that was her name. Maybe the Arthesis could be a character, who knows. Anyways, let me show you guys my scout on my other account that I did, because I said I wasn't going to pull in this account, but I ended up doing it anyway. Alright, here's my scout. Here we go, 160 on this account, and disappointment. Demanitized. But <laughs> we actually got something. <laughs> There's a possibility. I already know the outcome. I'm just I'm just trying to sound happy for you guys. Delia! <laughs> sadness. The ultimate sadness. Despair. Dongarompa. Okay, anyways, um, eventually I may pull on this, but not until if I get a character from this. If not, then I'm not going to do the weapon scouts. So, anyways, that's enough about that. Those are the characters. I hope you guys enjoyed. Enjoy the waifus. <laughs> but anyways, I did Master Plus One. I'm currently first place with 4.6 mil with these characters. And I was actually able to get no hit 38 seconds on Master Plus 1. But I don't know my outcome for Master Plus 2, so we can only hope for the best that I can actually get something. And I'm surprised, it's like been 2 hours since this came out, and only a couple people have done it. I'm very surprised. Okay, anyways, let's see how well we'll do. So, I'll show you guys how I did it. I'm sure Master Plus 1 and Plus 2 are pretty much the same, except this one has more health. But... 
um, I might not be too perfect at it. I just got lucky with the no hit. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I I would say at least one gun character is recommended. It did say that non-element characters will have more or higher damage if you parry them. So keep that in mind. And also it says to keep a good distance on them. So let me show you guys an example. So I can do two hits here, and then I can do that. I only brought this Austin up just so I can do like a, an attack buff hit right there. Then he backs up. He has that little flame thing. So I'm just going to keep hitting him here. That's all I gotta do. I'm back up here just in case. Then he'll, he'll come at me, bro. And then this one's just a kind of immediate type of thing. So I'm going to start hitting him here. Yeah, I'm going to hit him once here and then back up. Back up. Yeah, that he does that. So you have to be very prepared for that. And like it says, keep a good distance on them. And I didn't get a good distance on them. <laughs> no. I was so close on getting a good score. Okay, well, that was, that was like close enough. Okay, this one doesn't actually do anything. Just gonna keep a good distance, like it says. Okay, I think I got him. I think we're good. Under a minute. Oh yeah, if I didn't get hit there, I could have beaten this a lot faster. <laughs> Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> okay, but was that a better score? I don't know. I, I took quite a bit of damage there. <laughs> that one hit screwed me over, but that, that's the boss. Honestly, I thought it'd be a lot harder. Not that bad. I can get 5 mil, I believe. I can probably do a lot better than how I did this. But yeah, like I mentioned, those characters are pretty good considering they all have like over 10 hit combos and they do like a hit like later on, like a hard hit. Then again, now thinking about it, Asuna might be better <laughs> because of like that extra attack she has over a 10 a plus 10 combo. So just thinking about it, she might not be that bad. She might be better than like what I'm anticipating. I don't know. That's all in your opinion. I think Elizabeth is the best one considering she has 12 hit combo and she does have like three hard hits at the end. So that's like after like a plus 10% because of com over 10 hit combo. I think she's a lot better. Anyways, that's the event. Hope you guys enjoyed. Now we just collect my winnings here. As you see, I need 5.2, which I think I can actually get. I just have to do that without getting hit. Let me collect all my stuff here. I have a lot of stuff. I think I might get back up there. Okay, 600. We were at 700. We could have could have had 8, 900. I think 800. Okay, but now that that's over, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Sorry this isn't as great of a video because I'm kind of trying to rush this because I waited till like 12 a.m. to do this and I'm supposed to be editing by now and then getting to sleep because, you know, I got a pop quiz tomorrow. Okay, well, I could pull the philia. I can do this too. What to do? The cow says moo. Could have done this earlier, Argo. Could have had my back, buddy. If I can even call you, buddy, I'm still waiting to... <laughs> to know when to use those crystals. Uh, yeah, like, no smirk. Thanks. It's an avocado. Thanks. Look at all those tickets. I'm upset. First, I don't get the Kudaha yet. And then this is... <laughs> okay, at least I got Philia. I can get her to level 90. And I could also get her a 5 star. It is the 15th and they did say in the break battle they would add a special weapon. So let's see if they added that now. Oh they did. They did add a special weapon. And so I didn't realize this but I finished grinding this event and then I started getting stuff. But I didn't realize that they would then the notices it said they give off a special item in the 15th which is today. So that's why I don't have enough. If you did the event and you grinded, you'd have about 10,000 or something. But I should be able to get more because, you know, I still have, like, next week, which is, I think, tomorrow, we'll have more break battle. So I should be able to get multiple of these. And we should be getting another one tomorrow for free. And once we get those other two uh, guns, then we should be able to make it to an R4 for the free Kuruha. Am I saying Kuruha? I'm sure it's Kureha. I'm sorry if I'm triggering you. I'm trying. And they also mentioned for this Philia on the QT floor clearing event that we should be able to get her weapon. Nice, nice. They did say that we'd get her weapon. No, it's not like Bandit and Emka said. I hit my mic thing, I'm sorry. Nice, nice. It's something data miners have pulled out. So I believe they're giving us her weapon. I'm not too sure though. I'm hoping they do because I need a bow in this account. 
But yeah, look at that! Five star rarity! I'll show you guys her stats once I uh, do everything else. Okay, while I do this, I should recommend in the ranking event that you use at least one gun or one bow character. I think bows would be fine if you can get a good distance and continuously hit the enemy. Obviously, yeah, the assault rifle characters are good for the event too. So just have like a gun, a bow, one of those characters, and you sh at least one of them, and you should be fine with the event. But yeah, I'll eventually show a better run, like some other time, see if I can do better. Like if you're wondering, the Philia, without a weapon or anything, R5 level 90, that's her stats. <laughs> you're welcome. I should probably also let you guys know, if you're wondering the team I'm using with their equipment, this is just their equipment. I only had one of these. I didn't really bother doing the accessories, so like, uh, if I got the accessories, maybe I could do a little bit better on this ranking event. This is just what I got now. I'm sure people will find out how to beat this thing in like under 30 seconds. There's a lot of smart people out there. That's not me. And that's a given. Anyways, I want to thank y'all for watching this video. I've saw it on, on the memory D flag. If you guys did, don't forget to leave a like to let me know you guys enjoy and want to see some more. Subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you guys don't miss a video from this channel. As well as joining my Discord at the very bottom of the description. Click on the link and you'll be sent right to the Discord. And also follow my social media such as Twitch and Twitter at Kazuto Online. But anyways, I want to thank y'all for watching. My name is Kaz. Hope y'all had a fantastic day. And I'll see you guys all again in the very next video. And goodbye. Just letting you guys know, I might stream the ranking event to test streaming to see how well my computer will do. And that'll help me determine if I'll stream when Fatal Bullet comes out. And so yeah, turn on notifications and you'll be informed of the streams as well as joining my Discord.